And a very good morning to you. It is Friday morning, the 24th of June, the year 2022. And this is your friend, Angus Bucken, with a thought for the day. The second book of the Bible, the book of Exodus, chapter 20 and verse 15, simply says, you shall not steal. That's right. It's one of the commandments in the Bible. Stealing is such a deplorable thing, isn't it? You know, I was sitting having my quiet time in the bush, that's right, sitting outside a little thatched cottage that Jill and I had booked, and I was at total peace. It was early in the morning. I was taking in the glory of God, listening to the sounds of the African bush and the beautiful, peaceful creation of God, when suddenly a huge, vervet monkey... <laughs> It's funny, but it's not funny. He pounced onto my table. I was sitting outside the hut. And in a flash, he stole a bright yellow banana that I was looking forward to eating. As amusing as this may sound, it broke right through my time of solitary meditation with the master. I was having a wonderful time with the Lord. That commandment, thou shalt not steal, made a big practical impact on my life. You see, it's not just the stealing, but it's the infringement on one's privacy, isn't it? It is really saddening. It saddens one's heart. My prayer today for you and me is, Father God, let us not do that. You know, I've done it as an unbeliever and even as an, a believer. It's not even about stealing physical things, but of stealing time, of ideas of others, emotions, and even attitudes. Most of all, stealing time from our loved ones. I want to say to the men, Guys, please spend more time with your wives. Don't steal time that belongs to them. Spend time, mother, with your husband. Spend time with your children because time is passing away. And before you blink an eye, they'll be grown up and living their own lives. You know, Matthew chapter 26, verse 40, Jesus said when he was in the garden of Gethsemane, then he came to the disciples and found them sleeping. And he said to Peter, what? Could you not watch with me one hour? Don't steal time from God. He so desperately wants to help you and spend time with you. Have a wonderful day. And remember, stealing is unacceptable. Jesus bless you and goodbye.